We know how important it is to read stories to children, and if a child's heard 1,000 stories by the time they're five, they'll be much more prepared for school. In this week's Vital People, Tess Van Stratton looks at the success of the 1,000 times 5 project and the amazing volunteers who make it happen. These dedicated volunteers, all retired educators, spend Wednesday morning sorting books at Rock Heights Middle School in Esquimalt. Literacy is so important to me and to most of us here. We have championed early literacy, each and every one of us, in our careers. The 1000 by 5 Children's Book Recycling Project donates books to babies and preschool age kids in Greater Victoria, and it's about to hit a major milestone. If you combine us with the Peninsula Project and the West Shore Project, we're actually nudging 500,000, half a million books into homes where families need them. It's based on the idea that if a child hears a thousand stories by age five, and that includes favorite stories repeated, they'll be better prepared for kindergarten. It really provides a lot of opportunities uh, for families to, to start to develop early literacy skills for students, and, and that is crucial as they prepare to transition into our, our school system. These pink donation bins are set up in 37 local elementary schools. And after they're cleaned and sorted, between 800 and 2,500 books are given out every month. It's a big day when the books arrive. Through partnerships with dozens of nonprofits like the Mustard Seed. 1,000 by 5 has made it possible for low-income families using our food bank on a regular basis to, to access quality books. If you get it from the library, you have to take it back. And often these families can't even get to the library and so how nice this is, a gift we're giving them that they can enjoy and read over and over. Anne, who was a teacher for 35 years, has volunteered with 1000 by 5 since it was started more than a decade ago. I love books and I just think it's such a gift to give a child a book, sit curled up with the child reading. It's such a, a wonderful experience. Ladies, hands up if you started with this project 12 years ago. Isn't that amazing? Many of the volunteers have been here since the beginning and it's incredibly rewarding work. It makes me realize that I'm working towards a sense of purpose of something that matters in society and I feel gratified that I can take a lead in that. Vital People, brought to you by the Victoria Foundation. Connecting people who care with causes that matter.